Just logging on, I'm talking about posterior impingement syndrome. I published a paper on it, um, and I also put in a Christmas present in there for the rest of my, for my colleagues. So you gotta go read my paper and you'll see my Christmas present right in there uh, and tell me what you think about it. But posterior impingement syndrome, come here. I, 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 wrote, I wrote in there that, that you have to do it laying down because that's the test or whatever, but you can actually do it standing up. So this is what you do. You bring it to 90-90 like this, okay? All right, I brace under here, I bring it to 90-90, and I, I, I bring it into external rotation to end range. And, I, and when they say that they have pain in the back of their shoulder, my next question is, is, is it pinching pain? Would you describe it as pinching pain? And if they have posterior impingement syndrome, they'll always say yes. And then what you do is you say, I say, hold it right there, do not move, okay? And then what I'll do is I'll come over to the glenohumeral joint, and I'll do a posterior and inferior mobilization. And I'll say, is that still there? And then if they say yes, I just push a little bit harder. And if they say no, then I clean it, I cleared the impingement. So when I figured that out, and I was like, I was like, okay, well, I need to um, stretch the posterior capsule, and that should be the issue. And since then it's worked every time for me. But I describe in the paper that some people I put I can just push posteriorly. Uh, but some people need a posterior and inferior glide, which differs from the Job guy. Uh, he just did a posterior glide. Some people I could get, they'd be like, yeah, it's a little better. And then I'd, I'd add an anterior glide uh, going down to a downward force, as well as a posterior force. And they would say, uh, no, I, you know, I, uh, you know, now it's gone. Uh, but I said, interestingly, I've never had to stretch someone's posterior, uh, inferior capsule to fix a posterior impingement syndrome, just a posterior.